Hey guys, this is John from Walkthrough Code. So in the last lesson, we talked about bindings. And in this video, we're going to talk about uh, click events and just uh, events in general here um, in view. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, so I made a couple of changes. I kind of cleaned up what we had before because that wasn't super useful. But what I did is I added an input of type text that's going to bind to this uh, model called to do. And here we see that the default value of to do is just an empty string. Uh, so if we go over here, we can type this in here, and it works. Great. Okay, so let's create a method that will alert our to-do for us, but we only want it to happen if we hit enter, which is, it's usually a huge pain in the ass to bind the enter key, but in Vue, it's actually really easy. So we're going to call this method alert to-do, and then we're going to make this function, and we're just going to say alert this dot to do and then to tell this exactly what to do we're going to say v dash on colon key up equals alert to do and then we're going to call that and oh you know what we need to we can either put the key number in there or if it's a commonly used key like enter we can actually say key up dot enter and it will listen to our enter click. So we can just type a bunch of stuff in there, hit enter, and it fails because, because I said alter, not alert. Let's try that again. And we're gonna put some stuff in here, hit enter, and look, it actually alerts for us. So that's awesome. Um, that, notice we don't have any button here or anything. All it's doing is listening for the key up enter. Um, if we wanted to do a click for some reason, we could have a button here, um, and that button could have a, um, we could have a v dash on uh, colon click equals alert to do. And we could take this out. We could, you know, we could leave it in. That's fine. Uh, we'll say click here. And so we'll put something in here, we'll hit, we'll hit this click button and it, it pops up just fine. Um, we could also do something, uh, this is the shortcut that I was mentioning in the other video, or in the previous video. You can put at click and at key up, colon enter. Both of those will totally work. This is just a shorthand syntax and it works just fine. Um, see that works and then if we just click enter, it works just fine. Um, there are a few other things that you can tie to, but those are kind of the big things. Um, if you want to get a little bit more specific, um, you can look in the Vue.js.org guide, which is absolutely fantastic. This is one of the better um, sets of documentation that I've seen in a while for any framework uh, or library for that matter. Um, so we can go down here and see their key modifiers like that dot 13 um, we can do um, it gives you a list of which you can use um, it'll you can do modifier keys to where it'll listen for not only alt but also key 67 so alt and c um, you can do mass button modifiers things like that so only listen for a left button click only listen for a right button click um, it's just a phenomenal thing um, that they have going and it's just it just brings in a lot of cool stuff. So um, in this video we talked about how to um, Do click events how to do key up events um, We showed do that you could do key down uh, mouse click, you know things like that um, That's pretty much it for this video in the next video. We're going to show you how to do um, lists uh, Like you know if you have an array of multiple items, we'll show you how to um, loop through that and put it on the page. Uh, once again, so thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, totally leave them in the, uh, the comment area below. Um, I really look, I, I love when you guys like and subscribe. It motivates me to create more videos for you guys. Um, so if you have any suggestions for more playlists, totally let me know. I'd love to, I'd love to get that going. So thanks so much and uh, have a great evening and see you in the next video.